We want to go now to a sign of strength for the California Republican Party. Christopher just mentioned Eric Trump here tonight. And earlier today, we traveled over to the hotel where the California delegation is staying. And Eric Trump was the guest of honor. He was the featured speaker at their brunch. The president's son, of course, has been very involved in the campaign. And his wife, Laura, is a co-chair of the Republican National Committee. Here's what he told the delegates about the time he spends in California at the Trump National Golf Club, Los Angeles. The most beautiful views anywhere, the most perfect weather anywhere. Every time I could go out there, I go, man, if it wasn't for the taxes, I would. <laughs> if it wasn't for the taxes and the lunacy, I would probably live out here. You know, it's, it's, it's awfully good. And you know, some of the best views looking over Catalina Island and everything. I, I love your state. Another great statistic. Uh, California has bought more MAGA hats than any state in the country by a factor of a lot. <laughs> And we're seeing a lot of those hats here at the Republican National Convention, as you can imagine. Now, of course, having a member of the Trump family spending time with the California delegation and making them a priority, again, is a sign of strength for the local party on a national level. Let's show you the numbers, because I think within our state, People know it can be hard for Republicans to win elections in many areas. As of February, Democrats outnumber Republicans in our state by nearly two to one, with 45 percent of registered voters. Republicans have nearly 24 percent, and a quarter of voters are no party preference. But here's what delegates told me about a member of the Trump family making them a priority today. We are so excited to have them here. We are the largest delegation in the nation. We also know that California is responsible for making sure President Trump has a House majority. Uh, people and partners that can make sure his common sense agenda is enacted. And so we're going to do our part. But let's talk about what you're seeing here on a national level. Well, I, just, I think it, it shows that, that California is important. I mean, we're the largest delegation at the convention here, right? And we have a lot of powerful Republicans and donors in the state of California. And I think they want to make sure they're communicating with us. And so the fact that we have the, the Trump family engaging with us.